In other news, a Center for Children with Disabilities will stay open for another year, but only thanks to a controversial federal grant. And now the center and some parents are talking about how that money will affect their services. Jennifer Ah has the story that's Positively Idaho. Jem, I talked to one volunteer at Idaho Parents Unlimited in Boise. She told me the center changed her life, and she now hopes to help teens with special needs to set dreams and goals of their own. Idaho Parents Unlimited paints a brighter future for parents of children with disabilities, providing health care information, resources for music therapy, support groups, and more. 22-year-old Cammie Smith, who's diagnosed with a rare genetic disorder, plans to go to Washington, D.C. next week to inspire teenagers with disabilities coming from all over the country. I'm going to speak about um, youth transitioning out of high school into post-secondary, whatever they choose to do, whether it's college. Educate youth on their resources available to them. This week, the center received a new grant, almost $100,000 from the Affordable Care Act, which some opponents call Obamacare. This grant is the primary reason that we're able to provide health care information and resources and supports to families who have children with special health care needs. While the center is housed in Boise, it serves families statewide. And the biggest barrier for these families is access to information and services, especially being in a rural state like ours. Some say they now know their rights as a parent of children with disabilities thanks to the center. Getting a job and um, being able to keep that job and being able to have them work around the schedule of my son and, and as well as being able to uh, talk to doctors in a professional manner. According to Idaho Parents Unlimited, 13% of Idaho children have special health care needs. Now, Idaho Parents Unlimited hopes to continue to improve its services. The center is embarking on a medical home project that helps parents provide coordinated child care for their children. Live in the studio, Jennifer Ah, Fox 9 News at 9.